Microsoft Word to write. I, I, I do use Microsoft Word before, but uh, when someone introduced me to the software I'm going to be talking right now, you, you actually understand that it's actually easy. And uh, the truth is, these apps are free. You, you don't get to pay for them. They are just free of charge. You can download them for your phone, or you can also download them for your um, laptop, MacBook, wherever it is. Beautiful people, welcome. This is Raw Impact Africa TV, and the program is Nollywood Online Film School. This is a platform where we exchange ideas, exchange, um, get to learn new things, how to enter and join the uh, one of the biggest uh, film industries globally. Yeah, um, as you all know, we have Bollywood, we have Hollywood, and uh, I represent Nollywood. So on this program. We are going to be looking at the aspects of screen writing, as in softwares that you could use to develop your scripts and make your scripts very, very readable. Uh, now, globally, there are a couple of scripts, a couple of uh, script writing softwares, you know, there are many of them, but I'm just going to be talking about two um, very important um, apps or softwares you need to format your script and make your script globally accepted. Now, um, if you want to be writing for um, a, a, a profession, if you want to write professionally, you don't just need to use Microsoft Word to write a script. You actually need some software that tend to help format your script and make it very professional. Uh, you know, I've I've rejected a couple of scripts where people bring scripts written with Microsoft Word. Now, it's not as if you cannot actually use Microsoft Word to write, but you are going to be doing so much work. Um, you're going to be um, aligning it on your own manually. You're going to be aligning it on your own, you know, for understanding and readability. But when you use um, this few um, apps I'm going to be sharing with you uh, this um, um, today, you will actually know that uh, script formatting is actually easy. You know, it 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 makes uh, a reader, you know, either you're pitching for a producer, pitching to a director, whoever you're pitching to, it to be very very easy for the person to watch and understand. Before now, almost everybody uses Microsoft Word to write. I I I, I do use Microsoft Word before, but uh, when someone introduced me to the software I'm going to be talking right now, you you actually understand that it's actually easy. And uh, the truth is, these apps are free. You, you don't get to pay for them. They are just free of charge. You can download them for your phone, or you can also download them for your um, laptop, MacBook, wherever it is. You can download these apps and use them to make your scripts very, very professional. And whoever carries your script to read, the person will understand what you're writing, and the person want to read what you're writing. Now, when you write with Microsoft Word, you know, without formatting, it actually becomes very difficult to read. You know, you you don't really want to read it, so everything is just jam packed. But with these apps, they have a way of separating them. You know, they just allow them for you to uh, uh, um, read them with ease. And uh, the beauty of it too is um, some of these apps also have uh, scheduling plans where you can actually schedule your shoot, do budget, and everything all in that app so it's actually very very nice and like final draft a uh, final draft 7 even has a place where you can actually read your script you know you after you finish writing you want to play back the script to hear how it is you now go there set it up and put it change different different uh, voices for all the actors and um, I mean it really makes work really really easy so uh, if you're just joining us and you've not subscribed to my channel I want to urge you right now to hit the notification button, subscribe, like, comment, share, and talk to someone about this channel. And if there's something you really want us to also look at, you know, you know, any topic that is disturbing you in being a good filmmaker, you can also share it with me. I'll do the best I can to solve your problem. And where I cannot solve your problem, I have other big mentors and colleagues who can actually solve your problem. So um, today we are looking at scripts or softwares for formatting and writing script and making it easy. 
and uh, there are a lot of them. I'm actually not going to be touching all. I'm actually just going to be talking about two, and um, they are called Celtics and Final Draft. How we got that Celtics? Celtics is spelled C E L T I X. That's Celtics. Then Final Draft. Final Draft is F I N A L. Then Draft D R E F T. Now these two um, apps are very very good. I really really want to recommend them for you if you are a scriptwriter. What do these um, apps do? What they do is, as you're writing. They are formatting your script automatically. You actually don't need to go back to start formatting. Now, when you're writing a script, the first thing you see is the heading. Under the heading, we have exterior, location, and time. Did you get that? Exterior, location, and time. Exterior now has to do with where is this thing happening is it inside is it outside if it's inside you use the short form of int to write it then if it's outside you use ext that stands for exterior or interior now this is very fundamental and important because when you finish writing your script whoever that looks at it already automatically knows that this scene is happening outside or this scene is happening inside and guess what it is actually also going to help everybody who is part of that project to have an understanding that this thing is happening outside it's going to help the costumier because the clothes you wear when you're outside are also different from the clothes you wear when you're inside it's also going to help the lighting person to understand that okay i'm going to be lighting exterior or I'm going to be lighting interior. What kind of lights do I need to light exterior? What kind of lights do I need to light interior? It's not going to help the director, cinematographer to understand the lenses to use, the filter to use, and a whole lot. So that now helps us to understand that making the workflow of a production actually begins with when the scriptwriter is able to outline and make everybody to be at par at what's happening. That's why the first most important thing you see in any script is the place of action, which has to do with interior or exterior. Now, there are cases where you have interior, slow, interior slash exterior. That has to do with when a car is moving. Now, a car now is interior, but the, what is happening is inside. So in that case now, you now have what we call exterior and interior in one sense. Now, after the place, we now have to say, okay, location, where is this happening? You can say interior, lounge, interior, bedroom, interior, kitchen, interior, uh, uh, bathroom, or you could say exterior, field, exterior, compound, exterior, um, office building, exterior, marketplace, exterior, church, exterior, forest, whatever it is. Now, you already understand that it's happening outside and the place, the location where it's happening, it's actually the place where it's going to be. This will also help everybody who is on the project to understand how and what to plan. Then after that now, the next most important part, you need to understand that Celtics and Final Drafts helps you to arrange is the time of the day. Now, when we're talking about time of the day, time of day is actually basically broken into two. It's actually not really important. It's only in very rare cases where you need to specify early morning, hot afternoon, or cool evening. No. The major uh, places to look at when you're putting your time of the day is either happening in the night or it's happening in the day. So if it's in the day, you write exterior marketplace day or exterior marketplace night. You know, I, 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 I just hope you understand the whole workflow. Now, this helps. This is um, the, the format that Celtics and Final um, Celtics and um, Celtics and Final Draft has been able to inculcate into the app, so that as you go writing, it makes the work very, very easy for you. So after writing exterior uh, and the place and the time, the next thing you see again that. These apps have been able to put out there for you 
is an action. Now, an action basically is always a short description of what your scene is all about. For those who are writing for the first time, a short description of what your scene is all about. Emmanuel, tall, handsome guy, walks out from a door and comes. It's about entering his car. Then the wife storms in. That is an action. Now, when after you've written your heading, down below, you will see where you now put your action. And the action is actually, uh, the action is always centralized, as in it, it's ju fully justified, sorry, where it's, it gives you one space between, um, it gives you a space between the, 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 the heading and um, where you now put the action. A very short description of what the whole scene is all about. That also ha is highlighted. Celtics and Final Draft has a way of uh, um, doing that for you. Then after that now, when you now type enter key, it will now bring you down and you now see character. Character now has to do with the actor, uh, uh, the character who is playing the role. And one beautiful thing with this app is, whenever you, once you type one character, next time you type that character again, you don't need to type it all over. It just has a way of auto-generating it for you and you just keep on um, typing. So after the character and the name, and character is always in capital letter. Character is capital letter, then heading is capital letter, but um, the action is always, um, you know, just like the way normal sentences are. So, when you now type your character, you now, now, you now go down, it will now give you format for dialogue. Dialogue now is what that the actor is saying. And dialogue has a way of, it brings it down a little, shifts it to the right, then you now have your dialogue. Dialogue is a little bit centralized. Dialogue is centralized, character is centralized. Now, with this one now, it helps you to read your your, your, your script very, very well. And it's really, it's really, really super easy. Trust me. It's really, really super easy. It makes it so, so, so easy for somebody to write then somebody to, to read. When a script is just, you know, what Africans call jaga jaga, everything is just packed in full there. It now becomes uh, uh, pretty difficult for anyone to read your script. I, I just uh, 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 hope you, you can actually try some of these things. They're actually not uh, difficult. All you need to do is just to go to your Google Play um, or, to your, uh, or to your Apple Store, click download and you see Celtics and you see a final draft and you download them. They are for free, as in, as in for free. I've been using it for a very long time and um, they have really made my uh, script writing uh, quite easy. Then when you go down now, after you finish with your action, you click down, it now take you to either another heading, maybe you're changing a scene or it takes you to another character. That's how you can continue. Just experiment with them. Then when it now goes down, they now have another place where you, now, you can now put um, um, uh, fade in, fade out, you know, where you can also put parentheses, depending on how you want to do. But the beauty is that all of this is automatic. You actually don't need to start uh, manipulating it uh, manually. You just go ahead and um, 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 it just has a way of just fitting in, fitting it in into your write-up. And I mean, before you know it, your your script is ready and people can watch it and understand it and they can have a beautiful flow of what you're saying so i want to encourage you to stop writing with microsoft word take your script on our level by uh, making them look you know really good and write professionally you know so that uh, if you're pitching you cannot be pitching for a job fan for amazon or uh, prime time uh, um, um, amazon or netflix and you're writing it on on um on, on, on microsoft word no one is going to take it serious they actually want to see your script professionally formatted that actually makes you know that you are about entering into the next level of filmmaking so uh, this is how far we are going to go today and on our subsequent edition i'm actually going to do the comparative analysis between final draft and celtics let us know which is actually better we are going to do this i'm going to i'm going to do this video for you final draft or celtics which is better which has more advantages than the other that's going to come on my second video i am going to be signing out here i want to um, ask you if you're not subscribed to our channel quickly subscribe to this channel if there's anything you want to talk about on the film industry just hit me up and i'll do my best to bring it to you and make you understand what uh, coming into nollywood is all about and this is also good news for upcoming new filmmakers if you want to um if your thing is um, you want to 
as a, a new a, a, a young filmmaker i want to upgrade your, your yourself and learn professional filmmaking i have good news for you unleash your creativity is out there right now what are you waiting for quickly go to www.rawimpactafricatv.org and get yourself registered this is a platform where you are going to be mentored and trained by professional filmmakers drawn from directors guild of nigeria and actors guild of nigeria you're going to be in a camp for 14 days and while you're there you'll be broken to three different groups to make short films and the winning group guess what wins the movie contract and other very mouth-watering prizes that you just need to understand so um i hope to see you on raw impact africa tv my friends are really excited to share their experiences with you and make you become a professional filmmaker in just two weeks yeah two weeks alone you become a professional filmmaker what are you waiting for see you there as you restart for unleash your creativity and please don't forget to subscribe to our channel thank you very much and god bless you bye bye